everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh and I wanted to let you know my market outlook for 2022. So one of the things that I noticed about 2021 is one, it was a very bullish year and two, you could have traded the market last year in 2021 and had very little knowledge of what to do with trading and gone long stocks, many, many stocks, weak stocks, strong stocks and made money. That is not going to be the case this year, nor is it normally the case in any given year anyways. And I think a lot of people now are going to get hurt this year if they don't have a full understanding of how to trade or what to put their money in to make money in the market. And so it's going to be an interesting year. We've already seen the start off to the year as volatile. We sold off this week to begin the year. Again, you have to take it day by day when you're trading. But I will say this. A lot of people think that they know how to trade or make money in the market because of the bullish run that the market had in 2021 and because they went long many, many things and made money. And it wasn't a very difficult year to choose what to do in reference to the to, to the upside, okay? But that is not going to be the case this year. We are going to have volatility this year. We are seeing it right away out of the gate the first week of the year. And you're going to see more of that. So the best thing that you could do for yourself is to prepare. If you really want to trade and you really want to do this and you really want to get serious about it, then you have to learn how to do it, which is specifically a strategy that is successful in the market. So I teach my strategy on gaps. That is how I make the picks. I will go long or I will short. Last year, we did not go long every single day. In fact, I prefer to short. We shorted stocks in a bullish market last year and did many shorts and many options and puts, and they worked. So it's always good to know both directional biases. It's always good to know how to go long and go short, but it's more important than anything else in any market condition to understand what's going on in a strategy per se that you apply day after day after day. And it doesn't matter if you're doing long-term or short-term or options or day trades when you're uh, when you're using a specific strategy that works. You have to have something that is a set rule that you use, you apply it, and you make the choices based on that strategy. For me, it's called the golden gap. So I get up in the morning and I look at 26 points in the daily chart, and that's how I'm making the determination whether or not I want to go long or short, whether or not I want to take it, whether or not it's going to come in, buying or selling. Because again, that's how you make money in the market. But again, my prediction for 2022 is that many people are going to get hurt this year trading if they don't know how to trade because they're not going to be able to go long, weak stocks and strong stocks in this year of 2022 and make money like last year. Last year was an anomaly. You're not going to see that all the time. In fact, it's very, very rare. Um, so if you're interested in learning how to trade and you're interested in learning my strategy, I teach a class on my gap method once a month. Feel free to email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com if you'd like more information. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.